Good morning world. We have kind of a somber task to undertake today. The neighbor has some horses and oh, that's probably pretty bright, huh? The neighbor has some horses and unfortunately she has to put one down. So she asked me if I could come over and dig the grave for the horse. And of course I said I would. So I'm gonna go over and do that for her. Apparently the horse is 32, 32 years old, I think. I didn't know horses could live that long. Apparently they do. So that is the task for this morning. And it's been a long time. <clears throat> Been a long time since I did a video and throttle down. That's because for about the last month and a half, two months, now about a month, month and a half, I've been working on building this chicken coop. Uh, it's been it's been a fun project and if you haven't seen other videos of mine uh everything but the the uh the deck the floor of the foundation everything else was built from rough cut lumber from this property so my wife and i we fell all the trees and had a guy come out to the house and had the wood milled so everything in here is rough cut lumber from our property. And I went ahead and built this chicken coop. It's a 10 by 10 chicken coop. And there are the girls. Good morning, girls. We've had, we have the chickens for, I think the end of October is when we got the chickens. And it's the end of October, uh, November right now. So we've had them for by, probably a month. They're doing good. No eggs yet. What? What? You camera shy. Yeah, so I kind of mimicked the design of this chicken coop from the uh, Carolina coop. If you do a search on that on Google, you'll see the how they designed the Carolina coop. And it's really neat how they have the, the doors and then this part folds down and you can easily clean out the coop and we're going with the <clears throat> the uh, deep bed I forget what it's called exactly the deep bed method here it's about a foot deep and uh, it never stinks in there true it's only been a month but there's no smell whatsoever we just turn the turn the uh, wood chips over daily and uh, it's been staying really nice so far so this has been consuming most of my time whatever free time I have went toward the chicken coop that door was a, a Facebook find it was complete garbage when I found it the bottom of the door was rotted so I cut the bottom of the door replaced the bottom took off all the old layers of paint man there was a lot of paint on that door took it down to bare wood and still working on it still working on getting the getting it painted but all the all the layers of paint came off but anyway whatever uh such so a chicken coop and then here's the here's the roost box metal roof it's just I don't know I like it really nice we have a small run here the chicken wire keep them in so that's what's been keeping me busy <clears throat> so we'll go next door get this grave taken care of and we have a whole bunch of stuff to do today. A whole bunch of stuff.
is such a such a nice woman.
Okay, I can't see. There's too much glare on this windshield, so I'm going to keep on digging and I'll come back. So it's been almost about 40 minutes to dig in. I'm about, I don't know, maybe three quarters of the way done. Once again, the GoPro failed me, so I didn't get a chance to get a video of me finishing the dig. But there's the hole. Uh, I think it's plenty big for a horse. It's every bit of six feet deep at the far end. And then we have the access to get in so they can gently lay the horse in in its final resting place. And uh, that was pretty simple. A lot of dirt. Ran into a little bit of rock on this side, but no big deal. Everything went uh, really well. And the excavator, as always, performed beautifully. But it's an unfortunate situation to have to dig something like this, but uh, I'm happy to help the neighbor. She is a very, very, very sweet lady. And uh, part of the reason why I got this equipment was to help people. And I'm glad I can help her out. So. Um, it's done he had a good life and she has plenty of other beautiful animals that she can uh, take care of and remember him yeah there you go